Hey, what is up, guys? So, time to do the speed test comparison between the Samsung Galaxy S10 comparing the LG G7 Pin Q. So, as you can see, these are both phone right here on the table. So, let me just give a side by side comparison before I start. So, on this side, we have a volume up and down on both, as well as the dedicated AI assistant, which is we have Google and the Bixby on the Samsung one. On the bottom, similar here, we have headphone jack, antenna line, speaker, Type C for charging, and the microphone. On this side we have a power key on top they both have antenna lines same tray microphone so on the back we have a dual sensor camera compared to triple lens camera in the samsung so we have a dual 12 plus 16 compared to dual 16 in the lg one so we have fingerprint scanner behind the phone compared to s10 we have an in display fingerprint scanner this time we have flash on both and a hard image only for the s10 so let me just boot this up and give you more specs about the device one two three And let's see which one would are faster probably the s10 because having more ram compared to lg g7 having only four gigs of ram so definitely s10 have more advantage compared to the lg g7 but this time g7 did boot are faster as you can see it's finished already but still fall behind by s10 still loading the application and finally done now so guys, as you can see the display in the both of the phones, they are a unique display from each company. We have a LCD IPS display compared to the dynamic AMOLED display in the Samsung S10. Now the display size, they are both same, 6.1 inch displays on both. Also the resolution is really close between these two phones. So we have a 1440 by 3120 for the G7 compared to 1440 by 3040 so more resolution you're gonna find in the g7 also the pixel density as well we have 563 comparing with the 551 so the color wise the detail wise you can see the displays look really awesome in the lg so for the chipset wise they're both running qualcomm but we have qualcomm snapdragon 855 comparing 845 processor as well as adreno 630 comparing 640 gpu but we're gonna see how it performs between these two so we have 8 gigs of ram in s10 comparing 4 gigs of ram in the g7 also they can shoot up to 4k videos from the back cameras compared to front camera they can shoot only 1080p videos in both phones now the lg g7 ring right now android oreo compared to the s10 ring latest android 9 pi out of the box so that's kind of plus point lg did not receive the update for the android 9 so we are still waiting to get the update in the LG G7. Now for the battery wise, we have 3000mAh battery in the G7 compared to 3400mAh battery in the S10. So guys, let's just find out which phone is fastest between these two. So guys, we're gonna start from the phone data application. One, two, three. S10 is fast. Message application. I think it's same time. Play Store. S10. Moving on to the setting again s10 and you can change the night mode in the s10 so next is some social media application facebook i think it's same time instagram s10 also the picture refresh as well snapchat i think it's same time twitter s10 whatsapp same time now we're gonna open some games PUBG and let's see guys which app application load faster between these two phones and this is the one gigabyte of games so I think maybe the S10 is having more advantage here to run with its faster GPU and more RAM so anyway let's see S10 is going to win but still S10 actually did load the game faster still loading here and after like two second the G7 loaded up moving on with the S49 and still some guy having lag here as you can see I'm touching same time but LG is kind of opening a little bit late but anyway as you can see S10 right away and they follow behind G7 Tampa run 2 
and also guys you're gonna see some color difference between the display on this game so let's see s10 already go through follow behind or like two seconds now it's g7 but as you can see uh, close display you're gonna see more detail on this side compared to here but anyway i'm gonna play a little bit here and you can see more detail on this screen compared to over there next is subway surfer also we're gonna see some color difference on this game as well and the s10 a little faster followed behind g7 first of all guys the color wise the floor look more brownish over there compared to light brown over here same with the color on both screen I'm gonna play a little bit and you can see the difference between the screen moving on with the Mortal Kombat X and it's kind of delayed over there in the G7 so S10 load up faster follow behind G7 so next I'm going to open Chrome, that will be Samsung website as well as the LG website. And let's see which one loads faster. S10 loads the web page faster compared to LG. Everything I loaded up. So guys, time to do some multitasking. I'm going to open a few applications and see which one actually refresh. So starting from Mortal Kombat. Still in the background. So moving on with it. Instagram actually refresh in G7 open Twitter refresh in G7 let's open Play Store refresh in G7 let's open another game let's open Subway Surfer still playing in the both phones Of G still playing in both moving on with the Geekbench score so guys as you can see they both are optical processor and we're gonna simply run it here one two three so yeah guys I'll catch you in a few seconds when they are done so guys as you can see this will be the score between the phones I mean LG is not bad at all the score wise look for okay also speed wise as well as keeping like only two to three second difference between the s10 compared to g7 so guys let me know what you're thinking about the speed test comparison between g7 comparing s10 i know only social media application refresh during multitasking and the their internal application like a play store and whatnot but the overall speed wise only like one or two second difference between these phone so let me know guys what you're thinking leave your thoughts in comment section below i'll catch you next video Peace out.